One of the most memorable commercials in TV history is the Life Cereal commercial featuring the character of Life Cereal Mikey. Viewers will likely be able to recall the commercial instantly based simply on the character's name. Although Life Cereal Mikey has gone down in history as one of the most memorable television icons, the actor who played him has remained more of a mystery. Join Facts First as we explore what happened to John Gilchrist, who played the character of Life Cereal Mikey. The Life Serial commercial, featuring the character of Life Serial Mikey, premiered in the 1970s. The commercial became an instant hit for the cereal, perhaps even eclipsing the product it was selling. The cereal was being marketed as a healthy alternative to the increasingly sugary children's cereals saturating the market. And the ad campaign was given the difficult task of making kids forget the cereal was supposed to be healthy. The famous commercial centered on two quarreling siblings, as well as a third and younger sibling named Mikey. The two siblings had been given a box of Life cereal and were debating whether they should attempt to eat it or not. Of course, the debate revolved around the fact that the cereal was supposed to be healthy and therefore likely wouldn't taste good. Mikey comes into play as a silent hero, walking into frame and courageously trying a bowl of Life cereal for himself. His reaction is positive, causing his siblings to memorably exclaim the catchphrase, Mikey likes it. The commercial ran for 13 years and spawned various sequels and homages that ran after the original was shelved. The popularity of the commercial led many in the television audience to wonder about the real-life boy that played Life Serial Mikey. He was named John Gilchrist, and the child actors portraying his on-screen siblings were actually his siblings in real life. The Gilchrist family had seven children, and they were approached one day while visiting the beach. A producer saw star potential in the family's image, and the family took the producer's advice and got their children involved in acting. The Gilchrist children acted in a variety of commercials, and some got into other projects as well. But none managed to attain more fame than John did via his portrayal of Life Serial Mikey. At the time of filming, he was only three years old. Although John didn't even speak a single word, he made an impression on audiences that has lasted to this day. Despite the immense popularity of Life Serial Mikey, the general public knew not much else about John Gilchrist. Although the young actor appeared in a variety of other works after filming the famous commercial, his growth made it nearly impossible for audiences to connect the dots. Rumors and theories were often spread around schoolyards about what had become of the real-life life serial Mikey. One of the most infamous legends was that he passed away from consuming Pop Rocks. Viewers have likely heard that if you drink Coca-Cola and Pop Rocks, then your stomach will explode. Well, somewhere along the line, someone started spreading the rumor this had happened to John Gilchrist. Although most school students certainly didn't know the actor who played him by name, the tale of how life serial Mikey died from mixing Coca-Cola and Pop Rocks was spread through schoolyards across the nation, eventually becoming a popular theory. The rumors that Gilchrist had died from that eventually became so serious, they found their way to someone who knew John's mother. John's mother subsequently got a phone call from a sobbing friend wishing their condolences before reassuring the friend John was alive and well, playing at the schoolyard. Although the Gilchrist children were actors, their parents liked to raise them as if they were normal children. The Gilchrist children had assumed all kids acted on TV when growing up and became used to seeing themselves showing up on screen. This made it so the kids never developed egos, and many credit this for the children's continued success in life after their time as child actors. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to give it a like, and subscribe to Factsverse if you haven't already. The original Life Serial Mikey commercial was filmed in 1971. John Gilchrist portrayed the character of Mikey. His siblings, Mike and Tom, portrayed his on-screen brothers. The commercial began airing nationally the following year, and continued being aired for 13 years after its premiere. It was broadcast for the last time in 1986, though that wasn't the end of its legacy. The money the Gilchrists made from their children's acting endeavors was put towards putting those same children through college. This allowed John to get a good education and eventually become something more than just another washed-up former child actor. Before leaving acting behind, John had appeared in well well over 200 commercials, as well as other various pieces of media. And he went on to reprise the role of Mikey in a 1980s commercial that depicted the character as a college-aged young adult. Though the commercial wasn't nearly as successful as the original, fans were still happy to see Mikey's return. The ads that depicted Mikey as a grown-up college student weren't the only ads that capitalized on the nostalgia of the original Life Serial Mikey commercial. A 1996 Snapple ad memorably utilized the original Life Serial Mikey footage, digitally imposing over the Life Serial with different varieties of Snapple. Another ad featured a perfect recreation of the original, but with adults instead of children in the main roles. 
When it came time to pursue an education, John still didn't venture too far from his entertainment roots. He went on to receive a degree in communications at Iona College. Being a gigantic fan of the New York Knicks, John then used this degree to get himself a prominent position at Madison Square Garden. He became the arena's director of media sales, which means he's the one in charge of striking deals with television advertisers. In the classic Life Cereal Mikey commercial, the reason Mikey's siblings were so shocked to see him enjoying Life Cereal was Mikey had a reputation of being a picky eater. In real life, John has shared he isn't much of a picky eater, though he does have a real-life love of Life Cereal. According to John, there's always at least one box of life at his house, though he has to pay for them. Sadly, being Life Cereal Mikey didn't net the former child star a lifetime supply of the cereal. John has also shared he doesn't have a clear memory of filming the classic commercial, which isn't too surprising given the fact he was only three at the time. Today, John lives in Pelham, New York. He lives with his wife and their three children. Although not everyone will recognize the adult man as the classic character he portrayed so many decades prior, those who do will often stop John on the street and ask for an autograph. Unlike many other former child stars, John openly embraces his legacy as the character of Life Serial Mikey. John has always claimed to have had a great time during his years in the entertainment industry. Although John has always been able to laugh off the rumors that he died at a young age from mixing Coke and Pop Rocks, the company behind Pop Rocks never found the rumors quite so humorous. Apparently, the rampant rumors had a negative effect on sales, prompting officials from the company to issue statements debunking the myth that Pop Rocks could be fatal. The company that was responsible was General Foods. The rumors about mixing Coca-Cola and Pop Rocks started in 1979, and General Foods had decided it was no longer worth making Pop Rocks by 1983. They subsequently sold the rights to the product to another company. The company that ended up purchasing the rights still manufactures it to this day. While the formula that goes into making Pop Rocks has remained relatively the same over the years, the same can't be said for Life Cereal. At the time when the character of Life Cereal Mikey first popularized the cereal, it had much less sugar than it does today. The cereal could have truly been considered a healthy option back then, but is much closer in sugar content to the competition nowadays. There have also been plenty of other varieties of the cereal that have seemingly thrown the healthy promise of the original recipe out the door. The first spinoff was Cinnamon Life in 1978. The other varieties of life have achieved varying degrees of success, but none as much as the original, thanks in no small part to the all-time classic commercial character Life Serial Mikey. Now it's time to hear from you. Comment down below to share if you think that Life Serial Mikey is one of the greatest commercial characters of all time. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.